Meanwhile, scientists have created the world's first synthetic embryos, a groundbreaking feat that has now negated the need for sperm, eggs and their fertilization. The scientists at the Wiesman Institute in the state of Israel found that stem cells from mice could in fact be made into, se into self-assembling embryotic structure. Now, these structures have an intestinal tract, the beginnings of a brain and also a beating heart. The researchers believe that the work could in fact reduce animal experimentation in future and pave the way for new sources of cells and tissues for human transplantation. We'll be focusing on taking stem cells, uh, skin cells from a patient. Let's say I'm a patient, I need uh, liver cells and take a biopsy, make stem cells in the dish, grow them in special condition and put them in this device for about 20 days and they will make organized structure which we call synthetic embryos and these they have cell progenitors including liver progenitors or blood progenitors and we can take these cells maybe and transplant them back to the patient. The synthetic embryos are anticipated to advance our understanding of how organs and tissues develop throughout the growth of our natural embryos in the near future. Last year the same team had in fact built an artificial womb that let natural mouse embryos grow outside the uterus for several days. Now, the same device has been used to nurture the mouse stem cells for more than a week, that is nearly half the gestation period for a mouse. The internal structure and also the cell genetic profiles of the synthetic mouse embryos were 95% identical to those of real mouse embryos. The scientists could of course tell that the developing organs were useful. While this breakthrough is remarkable, the United Kingdom's Human Fertilization and Embryology Act does not apply to the manufacture of synthetic human embryos and they're not considered permitted embryos, using them to induce pregnancy in a woman would be illegal. Vyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.